Thanks to you too. 544 right now. A 42 year old man has been charged with second degree murder in the stabbing death of a woman on the downtown east side. The 55 year old woman was taken to hospital after some sort of fight inside of an apartment building near Princess and Powell Streets on Friday. She did not survive. Vancouver police have not confirmed a motive. This marks the city's 12th homicide of the year. Around 50 buses carrying some 2,500 migrants arrived at the Serbian border with Croatia this morning. Police say about 27,000 migrants have entered Croatia since September 16th, which is the day after Hungary closed its border with Serbia. Only days later, Croatia said it couldn't cope with the influx and announced it would be helping migrants travel through the country. Authorities have set up bus and train services, dropping hundreds of people off at border crossings with neighboring Slovenia and Hungary. Pope Francis is wrapping up his visit to Cuba today before he heads to Washington to kick off his first official visit to the United States. Yesterday, the Pope met with Cuban President Raul Castro and his brother Fidel. The Cuban government has anticipated around 100,000 people would turn out to catch a glimpse of the Pope during his visit to the country. More than 1,000 people have returned home after being forced from their houses thanks to wildfires in Northern California. Crews made significant progress over the weekend with the main Major fires, the two major fires that have killed five people and destroyed more than 1,400 homes in recent weeks. The blazes highlight the severe wildfire season that drought stricken California is suffering. Well, downward dog poses are to be expected, but this yoga class is all about the cats. The Cats on Mats yoga event was held yesterday afternoon in Vancouver. It was on, uh, it was put on to benefit the Vancouver Orphan Kitten Rescue to uh, raise awareness of cat homelessness and overpopulation right across the region. The nonprofit group rescues about 1,800 animals every single year. You know, you'd think with all the work we've been doing with spay and neuter over the past decade that the problem would be going away, but in the past two years we've actually gone up in our numbers. So it's really concerning um, that people aren't spaying and neutering and that are letting their cats get outside and reproduce. 540.